Hey everybody, this is Andrew from Kite Army. Today is going to be my third and final shootout video of folding tables. Uh, let me just tell you, people are very passionate about their folding tables. Who would have known? Anyway, today what I'm going to look at is the Works Pegasus, which I have right underneath my arm here, and this Ketter folding table right here. For those of you who are interested in information on the Craig uh, Mobile Project Center, there's a link below to a video or a review I did for that. Check that out. Anyway, let's jump into this video. So before I demonstrate all the wonderful features of both these tables, I want to give you some of the specs. The Ketter table on my left, your right, here, weighs about 25 pounds. It's available for about $75. This table is rated at a massive 1,000 pounds, so you should be able to put a baby elephant on this table and still have it work just fine. Uh, as far as the table size, it's rated at a total of 693 square inches. That's in uh, surface area on the top. That's 33 by 21. All right, in comparison here, the Works Pegasus is uh, costs about $99. It weighs also 25 pounds, so they're very equal in weight. Uh, it's about two inches taller than the Ketter, which for me is perfect for any kind of projects I'm working on. It's rated for 300 pounds, which any project I've ever done, that will work just perfectly fine. The surface area of the table is 31 by 25 for a total of 775 square inches. So it's slightly larger than the Ketter by about 100 square inches. Anyway, Let's get into the fun stuff. All right, this is the Works Pegasus. Let me show you how to set up this table. There you go. To break this table down, there's two little buttons on the side here. You push those and each of the tabletop will go down smoothly and lift up the bottom and you're back up into portability mode, back to the garage. All right, here's the Ketter folding table. This is the top. And on the bottom, you can see the legs are supposed to store in there. Now this table's not, in my opinion, as intuitive as the works to open up. But let me do my best here. So what you do, put it that way. Make sure your uh, sides are folded out and locked in. And then you have to grab what was the handle right here and push it forward and lock it in. You can see if you do that properly, there's a little lock. Uh, indicator right here when it's down you won't see it when it's engaged it's locked at that point this table's ready for a thousand pounds so to break this table down you do just the reverse you pull down the handle here and you push these sides in with your hands right here and lift up the legs should retract and if you get it right which I've had to put it on the ground and kind of jump on it to lock it in, uh, it should stay together when you lift it up. So kind of hold them in there and you're back to compact mode. All right, so let me really quickly go over some of the features of the Works Pegasus. First off, you have table dog storage right below here. They go into the surface up top and they can help you work on different shape materials like round pieces. They store below, no problem. You also have storage right on the wings here for your clamps. They go in really easy. You don't have to have them in any position to have them inserted. Now to put them into the rails, you just get this T side of the clamp, insert it like that, pull back on the handle, and they lock right into the table. To expand them, you go like that, you go like that, and they're, they're full size. So pull them off, pull back the handle, pull it out. I'm gonna put them in the center just to keep it really neat on the side, and into the side like so. Okay. To attach and expand the number of works Pegasus you have, they have these little grommets right here. They can go in this direction or any direction like, like this to connect to a table right next to it. So you can have a really large workspace of all your works Pegasus tables. You also have a number of just little compartments on the table and there's a way to connect at the bottom here I hope you can see that there's a way to uh, connect the power strip down here so you can have multiple tools plugged in so in a nutshell that's the works pegasus all right let me show you what the ketter is capable of first off you have storage right below here for the clamps to pull them out is really easy to put them back in is a little tricky and the clamps have to be in the exact right spot uh, to reseat in there uh, it can be done and i'm sure once you do it a few times it won't be a problem uh, to open up the clamps just like the uh, works you push a tab right here and you can expand them open 
let me put them into the rails for you. The rails on this one are plastic and uh, not aluminum like they are on the works. But just like the works, when you push it in, it locks to the table. Now there is something I should show you about these clamps. Here's the Ketter clamp, fully open. And here's uh, the works clamp. So you can see with the works, you can definitely use, use it for larger material. Also the quality of the clamp, in my opinion, is better for the works Pegasus. Uh, so in a nutshell, that's the Ketter table. All right, so we've talked about how these tables work. We've talked about their features and their specifications. Let me give you my summary. First off, I really like both of these tables, but they do sort of serve a different niche. Uh, the Ketter is, its weight capability is unbelievable. At a thousand pounds, you could drop a car engine on this table and it should be able to support it. Uh, the Works is capable of 300 pounds, so for me, that's more than adequate for anything that I'd ever dream of putting on this table. Furthermore, I really like the features of the Works Pegasus table. The clamps, in my opinion, are more uh, robust and rugged, uh, more options. You can put them on both sides. You can connect the tables together using the grommets. You can also use them as sawhorses. You can put a power supply below and they have the table dogs, just to name a few things. So for me, that is why my heart is still with the Works Pegasus. But for anyone who really just wants the same level of portability but needs a ton of weight kit capacity, maybe the Ketter's your table. Anyway, that's it for now. My name's Andrew. I'm from Kite Army. Please like this video, subscribe to my channel. If you love uh, folding table videos, you're in the right place. So check all those videos out and I'll see the rest of you and everyone else real soon.